Hello everyone. Welcome to a tutorial on creating a wireless dual stream deck setup with a Raspberry Pi. We all know that stream decks are amazing tools for automating your workflow and making your life just a little bit easier. This project created by Reddit user Mad Patter takes that to a whole new level by making your stream deck wireless. We'll be using a Raspberry Pi Zero W. To build the wireless setup, Mad Patter used two stream decks and two Malawing quatches and an XL. To hold the two stream decks, Mad Patter ordered a custom made 3D printed stand from Etsy. The Raspberry Pi fits underneath the printer's mounting and plugs into a four-port USB hub. And to power the whole setup, Mad Patter added a 10,000 milliamp hours power bank. One of the biggest challenges of this setup was finding a suitable software package to connect the Raspberry Pi to the target machine. We decided to use Virtual here as it offers Mac support and is stable enough to handle the job. Now it's time to piece this setup together and make it work. First, assemble the 3D printed stand and attach both stream decks to the stand. Then attach the Raspberry Pi Zero to the stand and plug the USB hub into the Pi. Next, connect the power bank to the USB hub and make sure it's turned on. The next step is to get the Raspberry Pi connected to the local network. You can do this using SSH or a USB to TTL serial cable. Once you're connected, install the Raspberry Pi OS, Virtual Here and any other required software packages. Once everything is installed, start the Virtual Here server and configure the IP address and port number. The last step is to install and configure the Virtual Here client on your target machine. This will enable the client to connect to the Raspberry Pi and user the stream deck over the network. With the client installed, you're all set. Now all you need to do is connect the stream deck to the Raspberry Pi and start controlling your workflow wirelessly. That wraps up our tutorial on building this Raspberry Pi wireless stream deck setup. If you're looking for ways to use your Raspberry Pi to make your life a little easier, this project is an awesome way to do it. So please check out the original project thread shared to Reddit, and don't forget to follow Mad Patter for any future updates. Thanks for watching and see you next time.